Hello everyone, in this video we will talk about the epiploic foramen, the only normal opening to the omental borza. So let's try to find or to describe how to find this foramen. So let's get started. We said before the uh, the borza omentalis or omental borza is completely closed and there is no opening here in this area here to the to the borza there is one way to go to the borza uh, and uh, this is what's called actually the epiploic foramen the epiploic foramen if we want to find the epiploic foramen we have to go to move uh, all of these organs or i mean small and large intestine to the side and finally we have to go dorsally there and find uh, a big vein located just in the, in the dorsal part of the abdominal cavity, this one here called the caudal vena cava. The caudal vena cava. So we have firstly to find the caudal vena cava. Next to the caudal vena cava, if you hold all of this small intestine in your hand, you will find there there's one big vein com, comes from the small intestine. In uh, this direction is the portal vein, the portal vein. So once you find these two structures, the caudal vena cava and the portal vein, you can put your finger just between them here, between them here between them and finally you will go through what's called the epiploic foramen so the epiploic foramen is that foramen formed exactly at that that level here um, if we go with our finger here through the epiploic foramen the first firstly we will end inside uh, if you can see my finger there inside the lesser curvature uh, inside the lesser omentum so i am inside the lesser omentum so if you go through the epiploic foramen first you will go directly to the lesser omentum lesser omentum here and from there of course uh, we can go to the greater omentum to the omental borza if you can see my finger so this is the only normal opening into the uh, omental borza omental borza again where is the epiploic foramen if you want to, if somebody asks you, or if you want to refer to the epiploic foramen, in this case, you have to find the caudal vena cava and the portal vein, and uh, between them here, dorsally, you can see where I, I'm putting now my finger is the epiploic foramen. If you go through, through the epiploic foramen, you will go directly to the lesser omentum, and from there, dorsal to the stomach, you can go to the uh, greater omentum. 